Stern Show. Then Bigfoot went into some rap about how he'd like us to help him become a competitive eater. That's his new thing. Oh, know? no. Yeah. He should put me in the eating contest, and I probably could win all kinds of money. Remember the time I ate a 14-inch pizza by myself? Yeah. Remember? Sure. And I have one other contest from my uncles eating chicken the four years and had more bones than my uncle did. I had a bigger pile of bones than my uncle Raymond did. Wow. So you're... you? Uh, I ate him right underneath the table. Yeah, I ate a whole deer it is while it was alive. Have you ever thought about becoming a competitive eater? Yeah, that's what I'm trying to tell you to get me into it is. And you guys got more fucking stuff going on and uh, get me in an eating contest. Who yeah, he's, got, he's obsessed with it. He doesn't realize that these professionals in that field, they really work at it and you have to do it fast. <laughs> They're not just going to wait to see how many bones you collect. Well, why don't you call him and explain that? <laughs> By the way, Bigfoot still has those squatters in his house, and they answer the phone. Bigfoot residents, Julie told me. Well, that was why I, I you know, I, I'm glad you brought that up because even he is using that. Yeah, the Bigfoot residents. Bigfoot residents. You think you had called a mansion? <laughs> yeah, it's like the Elvis mansion. <laughs> <laughs> and then he had a runny nose during the call, and he needed to blow it. And then he, like he, he asked one of the squatters for a tissue. Like they kind of help him out, I guess, with his needs. Are they all okay? I mean, he used to fight with them. Now they're no, no, all no. friends. I think he just kind of gave up and can't kick him out. <laughs> I'm not kidding. I got fucking snot running from my fucking nose. Can you give me a paper towel, Lucian? Lucian. Lucian. Hmm. Well, my nose is running. 